Get Crew. We're a team of high school students committed to encouraging our peers to stay in school. As a part of the crew, we receive training in leadership development, digital literacy, and filmmaking. The following film was produced as part of the American Gadget Fast Festival. Can I Kiki affords us the opportunity to tell our stories of trials and successes. We share our ideas. We document our truths. We give a voice to our generation. Can I kick it? Yes, yes you can. can. to know that, you know, every 26 seconds someone drops out. My thoughts are, why? For the first time I ever considered dropping out of school was when I was in sixth grade at Chastain. Um, actually, things have been going okay, I guess, but my math, well, I think it was, no, it was pre my algebra transition or something like that teacher told me that I was an idiot and she told me I might as well leave and she would talk about me to other classes about how she had this stupid girl in her classes and she'd tell them to try to convince me to leave. And my mother would try to go and talk to her about it, but she would like, then she'd start talking about my mother to other people, and then they'll just all come back to me and like people just telling me I'm an idiot and I need to drop out and such. So the first time I ever considered dropping out was sixth grade, and I tried to like do it, but I thought you, if you drop out, you just stay home. So I would feign sickness a lot, but my mother, of course, knew I wasn't sick. So she just was like, no, you have to go, you have to go. Seventh and eighth grade. My brother and I love history, so we would search History Channel, we watch History Channel all the time, we do research and stuff. So whenever she'd bring up something, I would tell her other things I knew about that subject, and she would just call me her special needs child. And she said that she needed to get paid more for having me in her class because nobody should have to put up with um, a student like me. I didn't try to drop out again then because I figured that it didn't work last time, so it wouldn't work that time. Then I got to high school and things kind of got worse because yeah, I had like new groups of friends and stuff. So socially wise, it was it was okay, but teacher wise, it just got even worse because my biology teacher wouldn't want to like help me with anything. It made me feel like there was something wrong with me because if other people could get it and if the teachers liked other people, then why wouldn't they like me? And what was wrong with me to make them dislike me? I guess they just didn't like my personality or they just thought I was too, I guess, awkward and weird for them. When you involve a student in something connected with school, when you involve them personally and you get them attached to something that they enjoy and they love to do, it gives a plus side to the negativity of so often associated with school. I regained my confidence by having more of a support group this year, like, all my friends try to push me forward because they see, well, they say I have potential and they see potential in me. And they know, like, they want to see me do good things. So they're actually, like, trying to support me. I have teachers this year who care and who actually want to see me be something in life and who tell me all the time that they see, like, they see the future in me and they see that I can actually do something with my life. Just by befriending each other, um, befriending each other, supporting each other, and being there for each other when when all hope seems lost. We're all in this together. Can I kick it? We're all in this together. Can I kick it? We're all in this together. Can I kick it? We're all in this together. Can, Can we, we kick, kick it? it? Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Kick it. Yes, you can. Can I kick 
kick it? Yes, you can. <laughs> can I kick it? Yes, yes you can. can.